Tory MP Andrew Bridgen lashed out at modern slavery instances in Leicester and took aim at the local Labour Party council for not doing enough to combat it. Conservative MP Andrew Bridgen insisted not enough was being done to stop modern slavery in Leicester. While speaking on GB News, he lashed out at the Labour Party for its failings. He insisted that both those legally allowed to work in the UK and those working illegally were being exploited in Leicester textile factories. Mr. Bridgen said, There are two levels of exploitation. You have got your legal workers, British citizens who are legally allowed to work here. They are then exploited by then having to return a large proportion of their wages in cash to their employer. Then of course you have got your illegal workers who have got no right to work here, in the black market. They would be the asylum seekers who failed their final appeal. They will abscond and also visa overstayers. They will be treated even worse. They are on about £3.50, cash in hand. They will be living 20 to a house, on mattresses, appalling lifestyle, very poor working conditions. It is effectively modern slavery. These people have no choices focusing on what the Labour Party has been doing. Mr. Bridgen called for more effort from them. He said, a lot of the blame must go to the Labour Party. It is a Labour-controlled city, there are 52 Labour councillors and one Liberal Democrat. You have got to hold that council to account for system failures. Mr Bridgen added what the government can do. Priti Patel has put in a task force into Leicester. This is because there are huge issues with HMRC, systemic VAT avoidance in that trade as well. She is working with external bodies and the police as well.